Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have a math riddle with nine boxes with unknown values. If we add or subtract, we are supposed to get the values 7, 9, 10, 6, 2, and 15. And now the question is asked to find the value of this X. So let's go ahead and calculate the value of this X. And here's the very first step. Let's go ahead and call this first box on the left hand side an A, the second this box B, this C, likewise this D, E, F, G, and H. Let's focus on these top three boxes over here a plus b plus c equal to 7 and here i have copied down a plus b plus c equal to 7. now let's focus on next three boxes d plus e minus f equals to 9 and here i wrote down d plus e minus f equals to 9. Likewise, let's focus on the bottom three boxes, that is x plus g minus h equals to 10. And here I wrote down x plus g minus h equals to 10. Now let's focus on the boxes the other way around, a plus d plus x equal to 15. And here I wrote down a plus d plus x equal to 15 right here. Now next three boxes in the middle, b plus e minus g equals to 2. And here I have copied down b plus e minus g equals to 2 right here. And finally these last three vertical boxes which are c minus f plus h equal to 6 and here i wrote down c minus f plus h equal to 6 right up here so thus we got these as you can see six equations and we are going to find the value of x we're going to calculate the x value and here is our next step. We are going to add all these six equations. Let's go ahead and first add the left hand side of these equations. Let's go ahead and get started. Let's be careful now. Let's start A plus B plus C plus D plus E minus F plus x plus g minus h plus a plus d plus x plus b plus e minus g plus c minus f plus h all right and now let's go ahead and add the right hand side at the same time if we add all these right hand side numbers if you do that one that is gonna give us 49 now let's focus on the left hand side as you can see that this positive g and this negative g they are gone likewise negative h and positive h is gone let's go ahead and add the add combine the like terms on the left hand side this a and this a if we add them that's going to give us 2a likewise b and there's another b right here that is going to give us 2b and here's a 1c and there's another C that is going to give us 2C. Likewise, we have a D and there's another D that is going to give us plus 2D. And we have a 
e and then plus another e is going to give us plus 2e and now we have a negative f and this negative f that is going to give us negative 2f and finally we got this x and this another x is going to give us plus 2x equal to 49. As you can see that all these terms on the left hand side are divisible by 2. Let's go ahead and divide each and every term by 2 across the board to make our job a lot easier. Let's do that one. We are going to divide by Two across the board that's the simple way so 2 divided by 2 that's going to give us simply a plus B plus C plus D plus E minus F plus X equals to 49 divided by 2 is going to give us 24.5 as a decimal now let's look at these terms a plus b plus c and if you look at this first equation on the top a plus b plus c equal to 7 so I'm going to replace this a plus b plus c by 7 plus and then let's look at the next three terms d plus e minus f and let's look at this second equation d plus e minus f equals to 9 so i am going to replace this d plus e minus f by 9 and then i'm going to just put x equal to 24.5 now let's combine the like terms on the left hand side that's going to give us 16 plus x equal to 24.5 let's move this 16 on the other side to isolate x so that is going to give us x equal to 24.5 minus 16 that means our x value is going to be simply 8.5 so thus our x value turns out to be 8.5 and that is our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.